I'll hold it to eternity. Never do it on a Christmas tree. <laughs> but never do it on a Christmas tree. A song about not peeing or taking a shit on a Christmas tree. If that's not Rodney Dangerfield, I don't know what it is. This week's episode of Two Freckled Friends is brought to you by my electric bill. It's like Snoop Dogg on a Tuesday afternoon chilling at the Paris Olympics. High as hell! having an impromptu dance party. Anybody have any more fun than Snoop? Coco, Mike, there's two of me out here. Two freckled friends. Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your girl, Allie. We appreciate you tuning in to a summer special edition episode of Two Freckled Friends. If your electric bill is as high as the sky, please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to the channel by clicking on that beautiful button, as well as tapping on the bell icon to stay up to date with the latest notifications as to when we drop new episodes right here on Two Freckled Friends. This week, I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm scared. <laughs> the good news is Brooke should be back next week. The bad news is she was really looking forward to this film. And if Brooke was really looking forward to this film, it's like Mary J. Blige. We are watching the 1990s animated film Rover Dangerfield. I am a big fan of Rodney Dangerfield. However, there was a time period, the 80s, the 90s, where a lot of stand-up comedians who were getting traction ended up doing a lot of animated stuff because studios just thought, hey, they're funny in real life. They'll be funny in 2D form. Bay Base Kids with Robin Harris. I think about Howie Mandel and Bobby's World. I think about Louie Anderson with The Louie Show. I think about Bill Cosby. We don't talk about Bruno. Did y'all know this film existed? Because I didn't know this film existed. Brooke knowing this film existed, well, ah, we know how Rockadoodle turned out. I still don't know what the fuck is going on. <laughs> Disgusting. Yeah, if you're brand new to our channel, what I'm going to do is I'm going to watch Rover Dangerfield. I'm going to give my thoughts and from those thoughts, provide this movie with its official freckle score. So without further ado, please keep your fingers and toes crossed that Rodney Dangerfield will not let us down. It is the one, the only Rover Dangerfield. Let's roll it. Here we go. And three, two, one, play. Oh, Warner Brothers did this. Okay, somebody spent some money. Didn't know that. I love a good old neon sign. I'm a sucker for neon. This is Arizona. Oh, what the? Is he spanking him? Getting out prickly pears? How many more are there? I thought he was spanking him. He's getting out prickly pears. <laughs> getting more in. <sighs> Oh. <laughs> it would be Rodney Dangerfield to pull off some shit like that. Las Vegas. Vegas? God, I hope this isn't like Rockadoodle. Going to fucking Reno. <laughs> the clear is the king. The king? Ooh, you're highness. I lived here all my life. It's a great town for people. It's even a better town for me. Okay, place your bets. Honey, you're my type. I love your pom-poms. I turned that before. Oh, I forgot you're a poodle. Baby needs a new flea collar. Ah! Seven. Y'all better check the dice. Put your bones where your mouth is. A chicken bone? What are you trying to do? Kill us? I'm sorry. Bets down. Put your bets down. Hey, here we go. Seven again. I'm a hot dog tonight. Take it easy. What do you got? A dentist appointment? <laughs> Rover, we got enough bones. We should quit now, right? Right. Wrong. Bet it all. You're covered, River. Come on, baby. <gasps> uh, oh. Come on, six with your bad ass. <laughs> a baby. <laughs> Gambling's no joke. Everybody loves a winner. Everybody loves a winner. You got no one to hold them and fold them. Look who's in town. Carmine's Canines. I used to work with them when I was a pup. How you doing? Oh. Hey. Is this like a knockoff Oliver and Company? <laughs> <laughs> Say hello to my friend Eddie. Where's Flappy? Carmine fired him. Couldn't remember the routine. Flappy was dumb. He used to walk backwards and wag his head. Carmine taught him how to sit. He forgot how to stand. He just ate! 
Wow. Don't you miss show business? I love my life in Las Vegas. Wouldn't change it for anything. Why, it's a dog's life and I love it. Las Vegas is the place for me. Songs? This is the place to throw your cares away. The showgirls, the gambling, the dancing, the fun. And this is for kids? That's funny. And hey, Fifi, get those legs up there. Lord have mercy. Showgirls must have stolen from this. We'll paint the town yellow. He said paint the town yellow. <laughs> the rub downs, the grooming, it's all for free. See shows that I shouldn't see. This girl's the law. Got rid of two, now I'm down to only four. Dogs, five, five, five. As someone who has been to Vegas multiple times, it's not a place to live. You can live there, but outside of the strip, it's no bueno. Happy birthday, Connie. Ain't got one woman of color, a bunch of orange tans. Ain't got one sister showgirl with cakes and peaches and yams. Where the hell are my green eggs and hams? I do not like green eggs and ham. I do not like them, Sam I am. I can't believe Rocky is here. Mm -hmm. Some boyfriend. It's all right. Must have had something important to do. Hmm. What's his game? What rating was this? Was this G? This had to have been PG-13. There's no way. He's Rover Dangerfield, a dog that gets no respect. No respect at all. Rover, what are you doing here? You wouldn't forget my birthday. Ew! Girls. Rocky, today's my birthday. Where were you? I was working. He's a real workaholic. You mention work, he gets drunk. You <laughs> <laughs> must beat it. What she sees in that guy, I'll never know. This is really Rodney Dangerfield in dog form in Vegas. I know I'm ugly. My dog found out we look alike. He killed himself. <laughs> Again, a knockoff Oliver and company. Stupid dogs. Let's see what's going on. Brooke. <laughs> You hear? Isn't that Connie's boyfriend? It's all here. That's another one of his phony deals. The cops! It's a setup. I got the stuff. Let's go. Wait, it's just a dog. Let's move. Last chance, small time. <laughs> Rover, you're mine! I'm gonna get you! What? Rover, wake up, honey. I'm leaving uh. now. I'm going on the road. The road? Okay, so she owns Rover. I'll only be gone two weeks. And her boyfriend's an ass. Rocky will take care of you. I'll take care of him. This is Showgirls meets Oliver and Company meets Rock a Doodle Bootleg. And that's upsetting because Warner Brothers made this. Come here, let me give you a nice massage. <laughs> I really have to finish packing. Alcoholic, gambler, hustler. You're not gonna help her? Let me give you a hand. Ass! Chivalry, where is it? Dead? In the gutter? Did you happen to look outside in the gutter? Love you. Yeah, me too. Damn! Goodbye, Rover. I'll miss you, baby. Police are rocky. Why me? You'd be better off in the street. I get Rocky. Rocky is a hobosexual. Yo mama's trap house. Roaches and rats are not the only thing infesting the building. They hobosexual also lives inside. You do realize that this is not a relationship. You have a homeless person living with you and mooching off of you. And besides, it's really... <laughs> 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 So if you've ever driven to Vegas, you can pass the Hoover Dam. So I'm familiar with that drive. That's the last time you blow my deal. Goodbye. Now you can't do this anymore. They blocked off where you have direct access to the Hoover Dam. Miss you, Rover. Wow, that's bold. So is he coming back as a ghost? I mean, got a big one this time. It's a dog. He's still breathing. Just says his name is Rover. No water inside of him? Let him sleep. Were they fishing in like Lake Mead or something? Like what happened? Oh, I drove all night. All night? Where am I? So, what's her name? Connie, Chloe, Carly. We're Connie and Carla. Do you like musicals? She is gone for two weeks, so he's got two weeks essentially to figure out how to get back to Vegas. Look, can you help me out? I'm trying to get to Vegas. <laughs> I don't know any Vegas. Oh 
on the range. What the hell is going on? Hey, I'm getting seasick here. I'm busy. I'm working. I'm working. Ow. Where the hell am I? Whoa! Machine. We picked up a dog. His name is Rover. We better just drop him off at the county shelter. I just got here. Give me a break, will you? Well, we can't keep him. We got too many dogs as it is. He looks smart, Dad. Well, when I was paper trained, I learned to read. Ugh, what am I doing? This guy's been around. You can keep him for now. First sign of trouble, he's gone. The first chance I get, I'm out of here. Where are we? <laughs> Uh, how do you do? That's the cow from 101 Dalmatians right there. Have you ever seen so many puppies? Aren't they adorable? What a vocabulary. Wait a minute. A barn. I'm on a farm. How quaint. Yes, yeah, so what's your name, Speedy? Raffles. I'm a sheep dog. Ruffles like the chips? Everybody works on a farm. What are you working so hard for? Don't mean nothing. He said I'm on a farm 25 times. I gotta get out of here. Where are you going? Don't go in there. I'm starving. Let, let me tell you, Rover, let me tell you. Dogs eat outside. You should have told me what you were going to tell me. Boys, this is Rover. He'll be staying with us. Max, Duke, Lem, and Clem. And what do you do for fun around here? After dinner, we howl at the moon. 101 Dalmatians. I can hardly wait. Come on, fellas. <laughs> yeah, I know you're hungry. Where's Joe to cook? <laughs> Dig in, Rover. You heard her come and get it? This is try and eat it. <laughs> take this, Rover. It'll make you feel better. Why not take it easy? Get some sleep. Kind of crowded, isn't it? Maybe I'll sleep outside. I think it's going to rain tonight. But the sky looks pretty clear. Glenn, you have a right to your opinion. I'll take my chances outside. Before. Sleep in the truck. What's that? The wolves. They've been known to kill a chicken or two. Well, I'm no chicken. Take your ass inside. Somewhere there's a party and a good crap game. A dog longing for Las Vegas. Oh, how I wish I was there. That's your ballad? <laughs> I'm proud of myself for staying awake. I'm not proud that I allowed Brooke to put this on the list. Big Mouth. I mean, who asked for a wake-up call? All I can hear is cock a -dee. Hey, what's all this fuss? Trying to lay in there. Oh, uh, where's that voice from? Guess I took a little too long getting ready. The movie's over. So it's our date. Bye. My mother never did like you. You're really henpecked. Shut up. Stop picking on him. And I, oh. Who do you think you're talking to? You're not married to me. That bird is like Abby in The Second Last of Us. We're done. No more cockadoodle do, right? <laughs> you pitiful excuse like a man. Get away from those chickens. That dog's dangerous, son. He was just playing, that's all. He definitely almost shot Rover. We're buddies. Tell that dog to play someplace else. Come to mama. Don't you ever do that again. Uh. Fetch, boy, fetch. I don't fetch. You go get it. A good boy, Raffles. Yeah. Raffles. So he's not a potato chip. And what's the point? Because it makes him happy. Let them run and get it. So what should I do? You do nothing. Fetch! Come on, boy. They won't play fetch with me anymore. Go to work. work. <laughs> okay, you cotton balls. Listen up. Your little Bo Peep days are over. You're gonna graze harder than you ever grazed before. Nope. Screw up your lamb chops. <laughs> Move out! Hey, who's she? That's Daisy. She's from the farm next door. Leave the sheep to me. I can handle it. Daisy, Daisy. <laughs> Oliver and Company! Oh, hi. My name is Rover. Are you a sheep dog? I'm in livestock management. <sighs> but not for long. I hope to get into it. I'd yawn too. As soon as I saw you, I had to run over here. And Daisy, you're the kind of girl I'd do anything for. I'd give up Las Vegas for you. I'd give up a bone for you. That's how much you mean to me. You just met her! Do you come here often? <laughs> What's your sign? <laughs> I'd give up a bone for you. What do you think, Daisy? These songs are horrible. The sheep! You'll sleep in here until you can do something right. 
Don't beat all. Doggone this dog I am. They tried to put him in the Harmony Hut. All they need are good friends, good fun, and a little time in the Harmony Hut. Guess what, fellow Freckles? We have some exciting news. Two Freckled Friends now has an official Kofi page. Kofi is the best way to stay up to date with what's going on with the channel, as well as being able to make donations or contributions. People have been asking us what's the best way to donate to the channel, and you can do that from Kofi. K-O-F-I.com forward slash Two Freckled Friends. You can choose any type of donation, whether it's one time or monthly. If you're not able to financially contribute, no worries. Brooke and I are having so much fun making these episodes. We're going to make Two Freckled Friends the biggest, best, baddest show it can possibly be. But if you're feeling generous with that tax refund, <laughs> I'm talking to you, Spanky. The website is Kofi, ko-fi.com forward slash two freckle friends. Again, Kofi.com forward slash two freckle friends. We'll also drop the link in the description below. All right, back to the show. Can you hear me? It's me, Daisy. <laughs> What? But all that cow see you. He'll lock you in here with me. I hope he sees you. I know you think life is just one big game, but you're not in Las Vegas now, Rover. Oh, I hate this farm. Maybe if you pitch in and stop looking for an angle, might get to like farm life. I miss the good life, the action, my own economy. Come on. I'd like to show you something. You really think Rover's gonna stay on the farm the whole time? We've gotta get Connie away from her alcoholic hobosexual with good hair. Good morning, fellas. What would it be today? Wide awake and raring to go. When are you gonna realize that dog is worthless? <laughs> Nothing but trouble since the day you found him. He's just not used to the farm yet, that's all. Keep him away from me. And why is this kid vouching for this dog so you hard? See, please stay out of trouble. Trouble's my middle name. All I do is get in trouble. <laughs> On the clean oh, clothes. Clean laundry. Get out of here. You don't belong here. I guess I'm nothing. Some dog. I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here. Rover. Rover. She stay on. Chasing men who ain't worth it. What are you doing? I quit, Daisy. I can't take it no more. I know you, Rover. No, you don't, bitch. No, you don't. You're not a quitter. Just like a man. You make it sound so easy. Don't give up. Okay, Daisy, if you believe in me. Bullshit. You loved Connie. All of a sudden, it's like, all right, I found a new bitch. I got a new chick, and she ain't you. The big white wonder. Good morning, girls. Has he changed? Bitch. <laughs> Move it, move it. Hut, two, three, four. There's nothing like this in Vegas. How long he been there? Don't. What's happening, babe? Oh, this farm isn't at all what I expected. That voice is familiar. <laughs> Sharing a coop with chickens. Well, I won't be here very long. You probably won't be around after Christmas. <laughs> There's absolutely nothing to eat here. Look in the mirror. I don't get it. Yeah, don't worry about a drumstick. You will. Wow. Wow! It's now Christmas? Oh. <laughs> What's the matter, Rover? No, they should ask my opinion. Trees, I'm an expert. Well, oh, that's where I do my business. <laughs> Rover, wait. I'm not like other dogs you've met. Another song? I didn't expect this to have songs. I don't know why. I'll never do it on a Christmas tree is safe from me. What would Santa think of me if I did it on a Christmas tree? What? I'll soak an oak, I'll splash an ash, I'll do it on a peach or cherry. If I sprinkle on a spruce, Christmas won't be merry. <laughs> I'll hold it to eternity. Never do it on a Christmas tree. <laughs> but never do it on a Christmas tree. A song about not peeing or taking a shit on a Christmas tree. If that's not Rodney Dangerfield, I don't know what it is. It's unfortunate this is the best song of the whole film. Never, never, never. Christmas tree. Something bothering you? Yeah, it's not Vegas. You miss someone back home, don't you? Another girl dog? <laughs> That's just like women. I miss being with Connie. If I was home with Connie, I miss being with you. That 90 sax. Why is it hurry, stranger? 
Yeah. Lion King with a trio. Yeah, kitty, kitty, kitty. We had our heart set on turkey. <laughs> Keep your paws off that turkey. I'm glad we're okay. <laughs> oh, Lordy. Gobble, gobble, gobble. I don't believe this. <laughs> I'm obviously breathing right He got like 10 kisses. What? I'm sorry, but that's it. Tomorrow, I'm just gonna have to take him out and... <gasps> Dad! The wolves did it! He don't see the wolf tracks? Bro. Bang. It's all over. Even though the turkey snapped its neck, you can freeze it. Goodbye, fellas. <laughs> Why am I laughing? What happened to spanking with a newspaper? This is hard for me, Rover. But you've taken a life. I'm sorry. Where are the wolves at? That one's for the three little pigs. I know what you're thinking. I'd rather be at Grandma's house. Ta -ta. Rover, you're back. Cal needs help. Come on, let's go. It was the wolves. Rover saved me. I heard the shot it and I... It started when the wolf showed up. Huh. Bro, back in the city. Hi. Rover! Hey! Daddy! Oh, your shoes. What you got there, little guy? Rover! I was so worried about him. Now when the world he got all the way out there. I can't wait to see him. Be seeing you, Connie. Bye. That's how they found out? If it wasn't for you, I'd be nothing. You believed in me. You're the dog next door. I'm in love with the dog next door. Let me guess. Connie's gonna come visit, and one of three things is going to happen. She's gonna take Rover with her. Rover and the new dog. Or she's gonna say, I'll come visit you, Rover, and leave Rover at the farm. Daisy. I hope you feel the same way. Every day we'll, we'll get up early. Herd sheep <laughs> will work together all day long. We'll spend the rest of our lives on this farm. Just like a man. Commitment. <laughs> Rover! Come here, boy. Where's Brooke? The lady who owned you called. We're sending you back to her. <laughs> yep. You just sang to her, bitch! You just sang to her! Fuck you, Rover! He was singing to get to them yams, Daisy! I understand, Rover. Goodbye. That's right. Goodbye. Let's go, Rover! Crash! Deuces! Deuces! If it wasn't for my pal Eddie, I never would have seen you guys again. Back in the city, doing city shit. How about the girls on the farm? <laughs> there was one girl. <gasps> Rocky! Look who's here! Maybe we'll see him. Ah, Rocky, what are you doing? What are you for good? What have you for good? Ah. <laughs> Never mess with a woman and her dog. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. <laughs> what are you doing here? This is set up. Wanna see Hoover Dam? I'll miss you, Rocky. <laughs> Wow. Look, Rover. It's your favorite. You guys haven't eaten anything in days. Is there someone special you miss back on the farm? <laughs> All right. We'll go see this farm of yours. She got a pink drop top? So she was willing to just drop everything and drive back to this farm because her dog was lovesick? Daisy, where are you? I didn't know if you were ever coming back. I, I didn't know what to do. So you left. But I'm back. He a rolling stone. Where he goes to the bathroom is his home. You're doing even more beautiful no. than I. You're singing in the key of fuck off. Don't fall for it, Daisy. It'll end up in divorce and you'll be a single mom. Rover. 
What they doing behind that tree? We miss him. You won't have to miss him anymore. That is, if you have room for him. Can we keep him this time? Can we? Connie says he can stay. Why, sure, son. <laughs> Welcome home. Rover. She's beautiful. Mother called me spotted one time. I love you best. I oh. What? Uh, I know. What? I'm a father of five. Six. Take it easy. I'm only a pup. Daddy's home. What? Oh! She let that man stick it up in her? Well, I'm going to catch her. When I want to catch her, I'll catch her. Alrighty, it is time for me to give Rover Dangerfield its official freckle score. A Rodney Dangerfield movie where he gets dognapped, thrown in the Hoover Dam, rescued by some out of town fishers who drive back to their home in a rural area where he then eventually gets discovered a father and son who end up taking him to their farm where he learns farm life and meets the dog next door, falls in love with the dog next door, sticks it in the dog next door to then just hear about the opportunity to go back where he came from, is on the next flight out. He really does love the dog next door. The owner figures out he's no longer happy, goes out of her way to take Rover back to the farm and the dog next door where he discovers on the same day that he is a father of six. And she was raising six puppies as if daddy was never coming home. And Warner Brothers said, hey, kids will love this. Let's teach them how to gamble. Let's teach young boys how they can always get the best girl in the neighborhood. Fuck her. And if she gets pregnant, who cares? There'll always be another opportunity. If there's one blessing and positive that comes from this movie, it's that I did not watch it with Brooke. Done a service for the community and I'm damn sure not touching this movie ever again. So my freckle score for Rover Dangerfield is 1.5 out of 5 freckles it is utter gutter i cannot believe it's not butter trash drop your thoughts in the comments below if you agree or disagree with my score have you ever heard of rover dangerfield while you're down there make sure you like and subscribe to the channel by clicking on that button as well as tapping on the bell icon to stay up to date with the latest notifications as to when we drop new episodes right here on two freckled friends i hope rodney dangerfield wherever he is i hope he was like yeah this ended up being really fucking bad, but it was a really large check. The business of America is business. Our most generous benefactor and newest freshman, obviously unqualified student, is very ethical or honorable. In all fairness to Mr. Mellon here, he was a really big check. I don't think Dr. Barbe understands the actual amounts involved here.